So it's been really beautiful to see Superfeast grow into this enormous contribution that it is since its humble beginnings back in 2011 when I started in um, Mum's spare room <laughs> in a west in, in Gladesville. And, you know, shout out to Mum for making it all possible <laughs> to begin with. From there, I mean, it was, it, it's really been humbling to see how many people Superfeast has been able to help. I was absolutely swept off my feet by Taoist tonic herbalism and I just dove into the deep end. I've been spending years and years and thousands of hours studying this ancient herbal system that came from ancient China and the tonic herbs and the medicinal mushrooms that come through that tradition, I saw so much relevance for them really becoming a huge part in our modern culture. A big part of what drove Superfeast to begin with is I saw so much degeneration of health um, as people were getting older and I just see the ultimate act of, um, gosh, it's like a revolution is people getting onto those preventative vibes and uh, really getting onto ty this type of herbalism, tonic herbalism, where the ancient intent was we're going to bring lightness to the body, we're going to bring graceful aging and longevity and just bringing our spirit forth so we can enjoy life to the absolute fullest. That's where we come in with tonic herbs like reishi mushroom here and that's why I fell in love with them so much and I studied it and since then just been talking to thousands and thousands of people from all walks of life and really helping them ingrain these herbs into their lifestyle and yes a lot of people are dealing with some chronic health issues and it's been beautiful to help these, like, help these herbs work their way into those treatment protocols but then bridge over into that place where these herbs are in the lifestyle, they've been used you know like just basically as a part of the diet ongoingly, they've been given to kids and just been given Everyone, it's just like it just becomes a part of the diet and then you're on the prevention bandwagon. So much of kind of what is going wrong with our culture is us moving too far from nature and really not allowing ourselves the time and the space to connect with you know the natural rhythms, the natural world. And something as simple as adding a herb into your diet every day can really take you back to that deep state of connection with nature. And I think these little little kind of reminders you know coming in through our biochemistry that you know we are part of this world and we are part of the plant and fungal kingdoms it's just so important now here we are in beautiful byron bay sending these herbs out to people all around the world and i'm really loving the ability now we have to tell the story of where these herbs came from the beautiful farmers and foragers that are going and, and finding these herbs and they're growing them and harvesting in areas that where the herbs want to be grown and where the ancient herbalists told us if you want the most potent, what they say, D-Dow, you want the most potent D-Dow herbs, which means the original place of the herbs, you go to this region, you harvest from this area, that's where you're going to have the most potent, energetically complete herbs that are really going to be appropriate when you are bringing them into lifestyle and your diet long term. And it's been incredible to tell that story and it's been incredible for me to be able to really be in the driver's seat of ensuring that I can get herbs where I'm happy taking them myself long term, giving them to my family, my friends long term and really seeing beautiful results come about there and then sharing that with the wider community. I think the responsibility is on us adults to, you know, find the wisdom from the kind of ancient traditions, modernise it and make it work and that's what Superfeast is doing. So Superfeast's job is to ongoingly stay present and walk this health path with anyone that chooses to integrate these herbs into their diet. We get to walk with them, consistently educate people. I'm constantly educating myself, keeping it fresh because we're just gonna, I'm gonna be here for a long time doing this. Superfeast just isn't going anywhere and that's my intention to really stay in alignment with the ancient tradition of where these herbs come from. And that's what really gets me excited and we're just beginning. The future is so bright for medicinal mushrooms, for tonic herbs and for Superfeast and for everyone that's bringing them into their lives.